My third source is the Kairos Preservation Project, a scholarly article by Tim Lockridge, Enrique Paz, and Cynthia Johnson. The project began as an independent study to address the challenges of sustainability by answering the following questions. How can we help graduate students learn the basic web literacies, such as HTML and CSS, needed to produce scholarly web texts? And two, how can we draw on research and best practices in the digital humanities and library sciences to develop a model for preserving digital publications in rhetoric and composition? This article focuses on educating future digital publishers by targeting graduate students and their instructors. The team started by practicing HTML concepts on old issues of Kairos. They quickly realized that these preservation efforts ultimately altered the original pieces of work. They learned that sustainability requires discussions and negotiations that are specific to each model, which makes it impossible to create a one-size-fits-all preservation model. This led the team to frame their findings as a pedagogical approach that is centered around three main takeaways. The first is that digital preservation efforts hold value within rhetoric and composition. Second, preservation pedagogy is an inclusive approach to promoting sustainability and accessibility. And third, labor and reward is a necessary component of digital publishing that can be promoted through this pedagogy. This article left me questioning, what are the key components of sustainability that would be useful to incorporate into a preservation pedagogy? Created using Powtoon.